Hey everyone, Tim here from QBKing77.com here to do a video showing off the Pi navigation system found in the Paranoid Android ROM on your Android device. This is actually available to install on any Android phone that has been rooted. So uh, kind of exciting there that you can get this uh, navigation system on your device without having to flash that custom ROM. So if you're just stock rooted, you can get this. So to install it, you need to install an application called LMT. So it's right there, you'll see LMT. Um, it is found at XDA. I will link to it in the description of the video, but I'm gonna go ahead and open it on up. You do need super user access. So you need to uh, make sure you are rooted, of course. And there's a ton of options within this. There's uh, This app's actually not necessarily just for the Pi navigation system. There's a bunch of gestures and such. You can mess with that if you would like to, but I'm personally not going to mess with it. Um, you will see, I'm just gonna talk about the Pi navigation system. You can get into the other features of this application if you'd like to on your own. But you will see Pi item, you have uh, a bunch of different options here. Level two for the Pi, level one. But we can go ahead and go into settings and scroll all the way down. And here's Pi control here. So you have activation area position. And it says one, uh, zero is right, one is left, two is left, right three is bottom, four is all. So I'm gonna set the new value to four, just because I want it in all of the spots of my device, left, bottom, and uh, right. And you can also change the activation area thickness. So basically how much of the activation area do you want there? I'm gonna change 20 to 60, just to make the area a little bit bigger. That's just my personal preference. You could change it to whatever you want. You can change the colors, the inner radius, radius, outer radius, long press time, animation time. So those are all just various settings that you can mess with on your own. I'm not gonna get too much into them. But once you're ready to go, you can hit start touch service and you will see LMT touch service started. And it also shows you the black, see these black blocks? It shows you the areas that you can uh, go to to activate this Pi navigation system. Don't worry, they don't always show up just when you're in this app application. So after you go home, you'll see they do disappear or after you touch on them, they will disappear. So now that the service has started, we are I'm ready to show you guys what to do. So uh, let's say you wanted to activate the bottom one, you just kind of swipe up a little bit and you'll see it will show up. So here is exactly what it is. You'll see you got a, a little time and then it shows you the battery percentage, ringer vibrate, connected to Wi-Fi, etc. You can also go from the right side here and it shows up. And then you can also go from the left. Again, you can customize that as I showed earlier within the video. So let's say I wanted to go ahead and quickly go to the menu and go to settings. Let's say I went to sound settings and then I wanted to go back. I can swipe up, go back. It does take a little while to get used to and remembering that you do have it, especially if you have a device with capacitive touch buttons there. Or you can just go all the way back home. If you want to do a quick Google search, you can. It brings up Google Now if you have that option there. Um, and then you can also go ahead and go to your recent running apps list. Brings it on up real quickly, which is great. And then if I wanted to go straight into Google Now, I can. I can go back home. Overall, that's just about it for the Pi features. I kind of wanted to just show them off. As I said, there are various settings within the application. Scroll all the way over, you have Pi settings over there. And also scrolling down, you can change, see if you don't want that area to uh, fill it up over there. You can change that. You can change the colors. Let's say you wanted to try red. Let's go ahead and change it to red. I'm gonna hit okay and go back home. And there you go, they are now red. So if you want it to match the specific theme you have or just a color that you like, you can change that as well. That's really it. So that's the Pi navigation controls on your Android device. You must be rooted. You guys will have to let me know what you think about it. If you think it's practical, obviously not necessarily practical on a capacitive touch device, but maybe a Galaxy Nexus or a Nexus 4. Let me know what you guys think. Be sure to leave a comment. You can subscribe to me as well. Follow me at Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. All links will be in the description of the video below. And as always, thanks for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up.